We may be known for our mild winters here on Vancouver Island, but when a southeast gale blows up Georgia Strait, winter on Goose Spit in the Comox Valley is nothing but wild. Goose Spit is a long narrow sandbar at the mouth of the Courtney River estuary. It was formed by the erosion of the Willamar Bluffs and is now a much cherished destination for many valley residents. Beaches and dune areas are among the most sensitive ecosystems there are. And it's a very special place and it, I think it should be treated as such. Goose Spit is a special place and it is also at serious risk from both the forces of nature and man. Rising tides and ever-shifting sand constantly threaten the spit, and after decades of experimentation by volunteers and the regional district, a unique, affordable process has been developed, and it even uses beach logs. Uh, what this is, is essentially is a, uh, uh, a natural barrier to the uh, extreme storm and the wave heights. The, some people might come down and look at the logs and think they look terrible. Some people love them. It's not Dunkirk, but they've, they've, we've actually measured the height of the logs to the height of the highest tides with the extreme storm. And the whole purpose of it is to just allow the water, the gaps allow the water to penetrate, to reduce hydraulic pressure, to allow sand to move back and forth through, but it also deposits over the top the uh, material, which then becomes organic material, which then uh, breaks down and allows the grasses and the plants behind to to generate. The slanted wall barrier is just being finished this spring, but it is already protecting the spit. There were no serious breaches of the spit this winter, and after 25 years of remediation, Goose Spit is a meter higher now than it was at its low point in the 70s. Well, Goose Spit is a quite sensitive area in terms that you have sensitive plants that are, are rare to a, a sand, sandy type ecosystem. If you go back to when we first started, the area beside the road was quite flat. There wasn't very many logs there. In fact, you could drive right onto the beach. So now you can see that there's quite a bit of material that's been captured. The sand dune is roughly about a meter higher than the road. While the remediation work on Goose Spit will go on really forever, the regional district has made other improvements to public facilities and access and local residents are responding in the thousands. It's the most beautiful spot, really, in the valley. It's the most popular uh, beach. There's over 300,000 visits between May and September. And we now have a nice, clean uh, beach. We don't have stacks of burnt uh, driftwood that we used to have in the, in the past. Goose Bit is lovely on beautiful, clear days and on wild winter ones, too. In the Comox Valley, I'm Mark Hanley.